Hello you guys and a very Merry Christmas Eve. Um, so it is currently December 24th. It is the day of Christmas Eve. <laughs> um, so it's about two o'clock in the afternoon. Um, I'm kind of just hanging out at home. My hair is, I don't really know what's going on. Um, I did go to the gym this morning and then just came home, took a shower, made some breakfast and stuff. We've just been chilling. Um, I am actually doing Christmas alone this year. Um, for those of you who don't know, my husband is, well, husband, fiance, um, is currently deployed. So he is not here for Christmas. And I honestly kind of just wanted to spend Christmas by myself. I did the, have the option of going to see family. Um, I'm gonna see family after Christmas though. It's just a lot of traveling for me because I've been away for so long already. Um, and have been really busy. I just kind of needed some downtime and plus it just doesn't feel like Christmas When you're missing like the most important person in your family um, so It sucks, but it's gonna be fine. We're gonna get through it. Um, it's gonna be nice and relaxing We're not gonna do anything crazy. So I thought I would just vlog and show you guys What my Christmas looks like? Um, it also doesn't feel like Christmas because it is currently 60 degrees and like not a cloud in the sky and I grew up primarily in the Northeast where it usually blizzards like three months in advance to Christmas so the fact that there is not a lick of snow and the temperature feels like summer outside. I'm a little bit confused. I don't understand what's going on, but I don't hate it. I'm not mad about it. Um, so yeah, it's about two o'clock in the afternoon. I really wanna do something outside because like I said, it is so beautiful out. I think that I'm gonna take the dogs to the park or something. I don't know, this is gonna be so chill. Like I'm not used to doing stuff like this by myself. I don't think I've ever spent like a major holiday alone before, so I don't know what to do with myself. I just, not that I wanna stay home and feel sorry for myself, but I really just kinda wanted to do the holidays by myself, but I'm also lonely, so <laughs> I don't know what I'm feeling. It's a lot of a mixed emotions. It's it's weird the fact that he's not here. It doesn't really feel like a holiday And like I said, I did have the option of going to see family. I totally chose this um, I don't know. It just it doesn't it doesn't feel like the holidays um, And even if I'm surrounded by family, I find that it's still it's not the same and so it kind of sucks It's a little sad, but I'm really excited because I was able to FaceTime with Nick this morning um, And they do have some time off, which is really nice. They're getting some downtime, which they deserve More than anyone. This is gonna be a really interesting vlog. I don't know where we're going with this um, But I have a few exciting things planned for this week um, and then I am leaving to go on a little trip to Iowa to go see Nick's family um, on Saturday, so this week I'm kind of just decompressing from getting home last weekend and I'm just running through the house doing laundry, that kind of thing to prepare for my next trip. I have a decent amount of work to do, so this is just gonna be a pretty chill vlog. We're gonna watch some Christmas movies. I'm not baking cookies because, listen, I gotta get my shit together. I cannot wait until January 1st to start like my wedding and 2020 diet. Like, it is crunch time. It is crunch time, people. Nick's gonna come home and he's gonna be like, you literally look like a potato. Because that's exactly what I have been. Hi, hi, you say hello? Are you saying hello? What are you doing? Hi, handsome boy, you wanna go outside and play? All right, all right, all right. All right, go play. All right, y'all, I'm literally like standing here crying. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed, but I just heard that the mailman came and I went to the door to like just see what we got because I didn't order anything and I had forgotten that my sister told me that my Christmas gift or I guess like the gift for Nick and I was coming today <sighs> you guys look at my babies I mean oh my god I literally opened it and I just started like tearing up so much like this is literally the best gift anybody has ever given me. Like, oh my God. <laughs> I'm crying because I'm like so happy and like this is just like so meaningful and it's amazing. I'm obsessed with it. I'm 
like over the moon. Um, so if you're watching this, thank you so much, Gloria and Alex. This is literally the most beautiful thing I've ever received in my entire life. I mean, they got Marshall's fit. Like this is, a, I guess I should even like preface it. This is like hand, like, is this a watercolor? I think it's a watercolor. It's like drawn. Oh my God, they literally got Marshall's expression perfectly, like super derpy and then Bindi always looks so serious. This literally is the most beautiful gift I've ever received in my entire life and I just love it so much. I had to share it with you guys. I really want to get them to like sit and like put this next to them so you guys can see how freaking accurate it is. I just like, it's so beautiful. It is so freaking beautiful beautiful I can't get over it like is this not the most stunning gift and the frame look how beautiful the frame is like it matches our house perfectly I don't even know where to put this because I need literally everyone that walks into our house to see it like I'm so excited wow am I a crazy dog mom or am I a crazy dog mom like let me know Good morning vlog. So it is currently Christmas Day. It is December 25th and it is about 9 a.m. I just woke up. Do not mind the mess in the sink. I didn't do my dishes yesterday because I was too lazy. Um, but yeah, so um, I slept in a long time today. Normally I never sleep in, like ever. I can't remember the last time I've slept in. Although I've slept in twice now on a vlog. Um, I just I don't know I didn't really have a reason to get up today and the dogs are sleeping still so um, right now I think I'm going to make myself some breakfast because I'm starving and it's Christmas Day I want to make myself a little bit of a brunch situation um, but I woke up feeling very very congested and I was sneezing and I just feel disgusting so I'm definitely gonna make myself some tea as well um, so yeah I thought I'd just show you guys what I'm making for breakfast and then I'm going to plop myself on the couch and we need to watch The Grinch. I watch that every Christmas day. <laughs> Nick just texted me, what did Santa bring the kids? I didn't get the dogs anything. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I have a very strict movie viewing schedule um, for Christmas. I watch Nightmare Before Christmas, The Night Before Christmas. And then I watch Elf on Christmas Day. That's how it goes. Those are my two favorite movies. I could care less about like It's a Wonderful Life and all that stuff. It's like, I'm not into it. But those two are my fave. Um, so I'm definitely gonna be watching that today. Like I said, I wanna continue filming some videos while I have some downtime. Um, I'm getting ready to leave again on Saturday on the 28th. So I need to do laundry and start packing and stuff. So today's gonna be just kind of like a chill day at home. I want to take the dogs out to the park again because it is a beautiful day. It's a little bit chilly today, which is good though. Like I like chilly on Christmas. Um, and then what else am I going to do? Oh, today I have to announce the winner at, let me set an alarm to pick a winner at 10 a.m. Or 11 a.m. But let me set it for 1030 so I remember. Um, I'm going to be picking the winner of my giveaway, which I'm really excited about. And don't stress. There's more coming. I think when I hit a thousand subscribers, I'm gonna do another giveaway. Um, we'll see. Or maybe a thousand on Instagram. I don't know, something celebratory for a thousand. We'll do another giveaway. I have some more stuff that I have stockpiled, like enough for another giveaway. Um, so rather than doing like one huge one at the end of the year, I thought I would do it now and then one a few months down the road. So that way I could kind of split the stuff up and we would have two winners instead of just one. So yeah, that's the plan for today. Nothing crazy, nothing exciting. We're just going to vlog like usual. Maybe Nick will call. I don't know. We'll see. FaceTime with the fam. Just relax. Enjoy doing nothing, which I'm actually very much okay with. I'm going to get some water boiling because... You girl, I've been on and off sick for so long. I just cannot kick it. It's getting really annoying. I think since like November, I've been on and off sick. It's frustrating, but it's fine. We'll get through it. Um, so I think I'm gonna make some chocolate chip pancakes. Yeah, that's what I wanna do. So although I'm having like brunch, I want to keep this like somewhat healthy, like decently healthy. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna do Kodiak cakes, the buttermilk ones. 
Um, and then I have some of these Lily's Baking Dark Chocolate Chips. These are 55% cocoa and these are stevia sweetened. So I do not use any other chocolate, any other chocolate chips, anything like that because there's so much sugar. You guys, take a look at like your like Nestle Toll House like chocolate chip bag. How many, it's ridiculous how much sugar is in there. So there's less than one gram of sugar in here. Like I said, they're sweetened with stevia. Um, so they're only 60 calories for 24 chips. They're just a lot better for you. I actually found these on keto because these are keto friendly if you're doing keto. Um, so I really, really love them. They do have eight grams of carb, but again, four of those are fiber and there's only one gram of protein and then 4.5 of fat. But so, I mean, it's not like they're healthy for you. It is still chocolate chips, but they are significantly, significantly better for you than the run of the mill, like chocolate chips. Um, and then Kodiak cakes are pretty carb heavy, but it's fine. I want pancakes. And then as my syrup, I'm going in with the Walden Farms pancake syrup. This is calorie free, it's sugar free, fat free. There's literally, I don't know how they do it. I don't understand. It must be like a lot of, yeah, it's a lot of chemicals, <laughs> but it's literally zero calories. So that makes me feel a little bit better. And then I think on the side, I'm gonna do some turkey bacon. This is the Applegate turkey bacon. Um, and I like it because it's chopped and formed. It's not like regular turkey bacon. The texture weirds me out and I just feel like it's so bad for you. So this is like actual turkey chunks just like formed together. And I like it because it gets nice and crispy. It's thick cut. It's so good. So yeah, I'm just gonna whip up some pancakes really quick and we're gonna eat some breakfast. All right, so I felt really bad I didn't physically get the dogs anything. Hey, get down. But they're such bad chewers that they just destroy literally everything. So I made them two little peanut butter bones. These are just like old um, bones that we let them chew on. And then I'll save them and stuff them with like peanut butter in their like kibbles and stuff. So Merry Christmas, baby. Good girl. Oh, Merry Christmas, sweet boy. He always wants me to hold it while he licks it. No, you take it. Take it, it's good. Because I'm not joking, but they literally, Bindi chewed the top off her Kong, which is supposed to be like the most indestructible rubber. It's not, she chewed it in half. So we now just get those bones because they cannot break them. Got my brekkie. Ask any of And we got the Grinch. Are you snuggling, sweet boy? Oh, oh he's sleepy. The other one's sleeping. <laughs> Look at you over there. She loves the pillows. Are you handsome? Oh, you're a handsome boy. Why don't you lay down? Take a little nap. Oh, good boy. Hello, vlog. <laughs> vlog, not vlog. Oh, vlog. <laughs> Good morning, friends. Um, so I am coming to you a, a two days later. <laughs> um, yesterday, I was just running around doing a lot of errands, so I didn't really have time to vlog. Um, but today is Friday, December 27th, and I'm very excited because I'm about to go get my lashes filled. That's kind of why I look like this. I'm wearing my glasses, and I'm just like in like super comfy clothes. This is actually an next hoodie. Um, but I'm just in really comfy clothes because I'm gonna lay there for like an hour. Um, and I like to be comfortable. So yeah, um, I'm gonna leave in about like two hours or so to go get, I mean, they still look like, well, I haven't brushed them because I just washed my face. They still look like kind of decent, but I'm leaving tomorrow to go see Nick's family. So I want Lashes fresh as a daisy and also I'm on like this membership program and I have a fill so I need to use it Anyways, so I might as well because I already paid for it um, So yeah, that's pretty much it. I need to stop at CVS and get like a few travel things But I'm just gonna have some breakfast feed the dogs chill for a sec and then we will get on the road um, The last place is in Cary actually so it's about an hour away which sucks Hold please Marshall's doing something no, don't, don't do that. No bubs, get in here, come on. He knows he's in trouble. Quit digging. 
Um, yeah, the last place is in Cary, so I have about an hour drive, which is super, super annoying, so. <sighs> but I'm gonna try and run some errands while I'm there. I don't know if, like, what's around. I don't know. I'm sure I'll figure it out, though, but today's gonna be just a chill, like, packing day. The weather is absolutely disgusting. It is gray as can be and so foggy, so I guess it's a good day to, like, run errands and, like, pack my bags and stuff. Um, I have laundry in the wash right now, so that's getting done. Yep, this is as exciting as it gets. All right, y'all, so I look rough as hell because I've been running around all day long, and hey, sis. Um, I just got back from taking the dogs to the dog park and on a nice long walk. We went for about, how long would you say? Three or four miles? But uh, I uh, went to Walgreens, super exciting. There's nothing in here for you. Um, after my lash appointment and stuff, it's like five o'clock now. I really don't know where the day has gone. Not anywhere near prepared for tomorrow, but it's fine. Um, I just saw, I would show you what I got that's super not interesting, um, but I got a mini contact solution, some makeup wipes. I like to use these just to take the bulk of my makeup off and then I will go in with like a liquid cleanser. Um, I just find that works best for me and then a toner afterwards to make sure everything is for sure removed. Um, I needed a little body wash, so I just got this Olay body wash. I don't even know. What does this smell like? Oh, it smells pretty good, actually. I'm into it. I had to get a conditioner. I have a little thing of purple shampoo, like a refillable thing that I always take with me, but I needed something for my conditioner, and I don't want this conditioner per se, but can I even take this in a carry-on? 3.38 fluid ounces. I feel like that's too much. Well, we're going to find out. Um... So I can basically use this up and then keep the container and put my own conditioner in there. It's just Pantene Smooth and Sleek Conditioner. It'll do. I'm only gonna be gone for like a week, so I'm not gonna be washing my hair that often. I only wash my hair like once a week to begin with. Um, and then I figured I would give this a try. This is the OGX Coconut Dry Shampoo. Refresh and Restore. Um, I don't know. Let's. I'm really intrigued. I bought it because of the smell. It says coconut and vanilla bean. Ooh, that smells really good. Okay, into that. Um, we'll see if it does a good job. They didn't have Batiste. I didn't know Walgreens doesn't carry the mini Batiste like CVS does, so. Then I just got a mini body lotion. This is the Nivea Shea Moisture Daily Moisture 48 Hour. This is the exact moisturizer. Excuse you, are you just making yourself comfy? <laughs> this is the exact body lotion I use on a daily basis, so it was really nice that I could find a mini one of these, and then I'll be able to refill it as well. I try and look for things that I can refill, just because it's so annoying when you're out of it, and then you have to go buy another one. And then I just got a mini toothpaste. Um, so I think I'm gonna go upstairs and pack my toiletries. I need to finish my laundry. Oh, I just, there's not enough hours in the day. I highly doubt I'm gonna do any form of sleeping tonight because I just have so much to get done still. Um, baby girl, what are you doing? What are you doing? She's exhausted, look at her. Are you comfy over there? Yeah? Are you comfy? She's like very expressive. You look like a little kangaroo. Marsh, he brought me his bowl. He's ready for dinner. Are you hungry, baby boy? Are you hungry? Can I give me paw? Hey, give me paw. Give me paw. Oh, he's a good boy. Marsh, give me paw. No, I want that one. Good boy. Why aren't you tired? You should be sleeping. Why aren't you sleeping? Are you not tired? He was playing with two really pretty huskies and he was having so much fun. You're such a sweet dog. I love you. I love you. Good morning, you guys. So it is Saturday. I am actually getting ready to leave for the airport. Um, I just wanted to, ooh, I wanted to um, basically conclude this vlog. I'm really bad about doing outros and intros. So I wanted to make sure that I gave this video an outro. Um, so yeah, I just basically, 
got in the shower this morning, got the dogs ready, packed my bags. I'm just running around the house doing some last minute things. I'm trying to leave in about 20 minutes or so. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna head to the airport. Well, I have to drop the dogs off at the boarding place and then I'm gonna head to the airport, but like, I need to do stuff like this, like unplug my Christmas tree. I'm so out of breath. Oh, okay. This is pretty much, I think, where I'm going to, oh, first, I need to show you guys because I'm so stinking proud of myself. Um, so I'm going away for about a week and this is all I'm bringing with me. These are two carry-ons and then just my purse. Bean, are you gonna go play? Yeah, baby girl. Look, isn't that amazing for a week, a carry-on? Well, I mean, granted, it's expanded. I don't know how that's gonna work out, but just a tote bag and then my purse. They were playing with my shoes earlier, but I'm so excited. I did pretty good. So yeah, like I said, I think this is where I'm going to officially conclude the vlog. Thank y'all so much for watching, and if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. Like this video if you want me to do more vlogs. As always, you can leave me video requests down below. You know the drill, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.